Hey guys, so um, today I'm going to do an a, a cheerful nail tutorial. Um, I've already started it, um, just quickly. I've added the base coat, which I'm using in technique, um, which I've now put away, so I'm going to show you just two minutes so I can just get my hair at least semi looking good. Okay, sorry, it's still not the best, but I've just got the old lot just stuffed it back right anyway um sorry yeah i've already started i've added a base coat which boom um this is this one technique which you can't see again because i'm using the webcam not my camera um and then i've added a white background which I do all my nails but it ain't going to be a white background um, and now you need to choose five different colours of your choice try and make them colourful because Ed Sheeran's colourful um, I like Ed Sheeran uh, so yeah any colours of your choice just make them colourful um, obviously the white background is completely your choice you can choose over to it or not but with my nail because I'm using the colour wheel they're um, they're see through anyway so I need like a base base colour that's a solid colour to give it that yeah just yeah um so I've used a white but when I'm doing up my natural nails and even with these ones I did a white background before putting it on and it's just what I do I always do it it's just to me gives it a more of a, a bolder look sort of thing so yeah, so I'll show you what I mean and I'll get my five colours and say what they are now. Okay guys, so just let me take these off first because um They're too noisy easy, so anyway, pulse notes to So I've used a blue which is in sinful colours and that is in Almighty. So it's an Almighty let's just move that no not there because that's in the camera let's see if we can get this to work most of it says when it's in uh, good lighting you should focus but anyway that's in almighty 941 and that's in sinful colours which you still can't see um, then there's this one which is an ultra magenta and that's Laval which anybody who knows me knows I love let's try and like get rid of some of the light don't think so wait till I get my battery on just gotta get batteries and then we're off uh, anyway then we then I've got a uh, nail polish Primark Beauty which is just nail polish from Primark which is really really good but the only thing is it's like in neon yellow so I think I might change my mind with this one I might go over that one you'll see when I show up in a second and then I've got a uh, sweet cherry in all about navels uh, sweet cherry which you can't see and then I love Rimmel London in lasting finish and that's in green grass so here is my look And so we've got the blue, the pink, the yellow, the pink. Let's start again. The blue, the pink, the yellow, the red, and the green. Okay, so now you're going to write the Ed and the Sharon. Um, you're going to need a black. Why don't I pre prepare for this? Um, I'll find the black, and you need a really thin, dotting tool. Or which brushes here? You can get like a pack of these, which I got the white ones at first, and then I seen the pink ones, so I want pink ones. But you can get like a whole pack of fifteen of these, for, like I guess like ninety nine p on eBay. Um, so, but when you can't find your dot at all, it's never a good thing. Okay, well anyway, 
And if you like me and you can't find your starting tool, just find the thinnest brush you've got. I like this one as well because it's like this. It goes like that and then it bends. If you can just see. Which is really good because it like you can hold it like this, like a pen. And it's just so much easier to do detail with. Um, so you're going to need that and then you're going to need a black skirt. I can't find. Boom. Love oil in black. Boom. Worked. Right, kind of. Um, and then obviously you're going to need like a, a flat surface. Which I promised you guys that I was going to clean that one because I was like an absolute state. But, and I have cleaned it, but I can't find it now. So, I'll probably go find just like another flat surface. Um, and, yeah, get back to you on that one. So, two minutes. Okay guys, so, I've done that. Um, using the dark and tall and the black, I've done this. can't see it as well on here so I will take a picture of that and show you that. And um, if you realise that the, the sheer and, and the edge, it's not really like neat but I didn't want it neat. Um, so, I can't put it in my nails. Um, so basically don't do it. Well, you can do it neat if you want it neat, but if you look at like, if you look, it's Ed Sheeran's not neat. If that makes sense, I don't know, but it's got some serious talent. Um, next thing is his. There goes my phone. Next thing is his paw print. He does um his his logo is a paw print like JLS is a star and that. His paw print and his orange. So I will get on set now only I'm going to do it on here so you can see. So two seconds. Okay, so what you gotta do? Now you can use like one of these or whatever, it's completely up to you what you use, but I'm just going to be using the the brush on the finger, so I don't know how well this is gonna come out. You need to make it like a pointy kind of blob thing. Sorry guys, just realised that you couldn't actually see what I was doing then, but um, basically you just, it's like a um, triangle, but like a round bit at the bottom. Just go onto Google Images, search up Etcher and Paw, and it will come straight up like the triangle bit that I mean. It's kind of hard to explain, but you see on the pictures anyway um, that I've just took. Uh, so, yeah. Okay, so here is the first bit on it. So here's the first bit. And now you need to add the 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 dots. There's a huge fly around here. I mean it's huge. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry, I'm using this and I've used it so much it's completely worn out so it hasn't really got a name <laughs> but that's it on the museum okay so it's the problem I will get a picture now for you okay guys so um that was that picture uh, of the paw. Um, now what we're going to do is on the on the blue, blue, which isn't blue on there. You're going to do you're going to do um, like song notes. Um, so yeah, I'm using um, my nail art pen. This is a uh, technique. 
like, um, which is really really good. Which honestly, I find a lot better than the the ones I got off eBay. Um, if you looked in my first haul, uh, these are in there. Um, which I find these a lot easier to use. So I've already done it on the blue. Just here. and i will get a picture of them up sorry guys just realized that didn't actually show you what to do it's really really simple just get your nails i'm just going to go over what i've done before just to show you uh you just draw like little notes just like this and then do like a little blob at the bottom just like that and do it again just draw your notes. Oh, now they're saying standing not right. Okay, sorry. Okay, now this bit is going to be a little bit more difficult um because what I'm going to do is you know when you do like a painting and you want glitter on it so you paint a picture and then you put the glitter all over it and then you tap it off. That's what I'm going to do in a minute. So you've got to like work really really fast, especially with these because these like dry quick. So I'm going to do it like one letter and then do it and then go from there. Um so I'll show you what I mean. Now basically you choose what you want to what song you want to use. I'm going to be using A Team because I like that song. It's a good song. Well I like all the songs, I love them. Um, my favourite is actually Small Bump but uh I'm going to be doing A Team because it's easy to do so it's easy for me to show you. Um so I'll start with the A. Like I'll show you that on cam. So what you got to do is get your your finger your stuff you just do your A you gotta work really really quick okay so there's my A I don't think I'm working quick enough if you don't work quick enough it's fine just go over it uh, I've got my box here which is my glitters and that Use dark pink. Okay, so I'm just going to quickly go over that again because I wasted time. <laughs> and then get your glitter. And then you just tap off. And if you have a look around it, you're gonna have excess um you know, glitter. But on the actual A it's it's got like the um this stuff to cling on to whereas the other one hasn't got anything to cling on to. So you wait for the A to completely dry and then you just get uh, a fan brush and you just fan over it I see what this is going to do is my racket because I haven't waited for it to dry yeah it's going to wreck it ok so just I'm just going to lightly go over this bit here in fact you know what I've done I had to go over the the green so it's still a bit that bit there is still a little bit dry wet sorry so that will still drip stick Okay, so something like that it will come up right. So it's just like a glittery A uh, and I'm going to finish that with um, team next to it and then I'll show you the picture. Okay guys, so that is the finished look.
last year, which I've just added a picture of. Um, I hope. Come here, boy. My doggy. Good boy, my doggy. <laughs> Right, anyway, yeah, thank you for watching and please don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe! <laughs> Love you. Thanks guys, bye!